A couple years ago, the TV show Punked approached my husband to punk me, and boy, did they ever. These two just go around moving Hey, clothes. before you start talking and blaming on me, who the are you? You're starting to piss me off. You may want to look at that sign. <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe you. Hey, I'm Jewel, and I am ready for a little revenge. There's three things that Ty hates. He hates to be put in embarrassing or compromising positions on camera. <laughs> this, is, this is really That's bizarre. Weird. Number two, he really hates it when they disrespect the sport. Is this entertainment, like, like a big world wrestling type thing? Or, I mean, is it like a real sport? And he really hates being around overbearing and highly energetic women. Please bring me around. Can you feel what's in this game? <laughs> and then I thought, why not all three? Amanda played the producer, and when you want the archetype of an over-the-top, just peppy producer, she nailed it. I'm gonna try some new stuff, so that'll be awesome. Are you excited? <laughs> awesome. It's so nice to meet you. You're awesome. Okay, cool. That's like a Saturday Night Live skit. Yay. Hi, this is Ty Murray. Whoa, okay, you gotta keep up with him. I gotta be honest, you're a little bit stiff. Hands out of the pocket, maybe. Bull shizzle. Sorry, no. can't see your eyes at all. Okay, you're gonna go, hi. Hi, hi. This is Ty. Ty. <laughs> this is this is really it's weird. Bizarre. I know. <laughs> <laughs> Hang on just a minute. Well, I wanna try something a little bit different. This is Ty Murray, and it's Phoebe out of time in Nashville. And that's no bull shizzle. And action. Hi, this is Ty Murray, and it's PBR time here in Nashville. <laughs> It was golden. I totally think we got it. Thank you so much. Mickey was the actor that we hired to play the reporter. I really wanted Ty to feel like this guy was a big deal and really important and that he could help really get the message out about what the PBR is and further the cause. All right, you ready to do this? I'm ready. All right, man. I found some pictures online and this was kind of surprising to me. Uh, really kind of shocking. My husband and I took our honeymoon in the Bahamas where we got married and there were some wild swimming pigs and so Ty, of course, being Ty, thought it'd be funny if he stood over one and pretended like he was riding it like a bull. I mean, you're what, 150, 160 pounds and that's yeah, probably even, a 60 I'm, pound pig. Yeah, I'm not even setting on the pig. I mean, yeah. is this something you're proud of? Is that <laughs> cowboy entertainment you got a hat on? I mean, was it entertaining? Those, those I mean, pigs, to ride a pig? Those pigs were doing, I thought it was a funny picture. Oh my gosh. He's going to kill me when he sees it. <laughs> hey, why don't we get back to uh, why we're in Nashville? Now, I'll, I'll be honest with you, man. I, I mean, I pretty much got everything I need for the story I'm doing. But just knowing on the inside that he wanted to eat that guy's face off <laughs> was so funny for me. Deal is, dude, those pictures, are they online? Just out of curiosity. Not that there's anything wrong with them. I think Twitter, that picture. Uh, this guy could be, I don't know, he could be a he Yahoo. He seems like a kook. <laughs> Terry was the actress we hired to play the crazy fan, and so I thought this was just the great ending to a horrible day. Mm -hmm. Nice to meet you. What's your name? Terry. Terry, good to meet you. You too. And I also thought it'd be really funny if she would allude to something dark in her past. Thank you. Thank you so much, because I, I just wanted to let you know. Um, you know, I've been through like a lot of hard stuff in my really? life, and I saw you on Dancing with the Stars. You I know? appreciate that. You, it was just, you were the most incredible thing ever. Thank you. You know what, Ty? Can we do just like a couple of dance steps from one of the routines? I'll hold the teddy bear and the autograph. Do you autograph. mind? I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> I'll turn around a couple of times. Just okay, really? Yeah. 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 There you go. Hey! 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 Oh my gosh, are you okay? Oh, honey, are you okay? Oh my gosh. Okay, just relax a second. Are you alright? Did something happen? What did he do? Like, okay, just sorry, sorry. It's okay. Sorry. What happened? What, did, what happened? Down here. Down here. I don't understand what you're saying. Did what? What happened? Did you hurt your ankle? Did you break something? He danced his manhood into me. Wow. He danced his manhood into me. <laughs> that line kills me. <laughs> yeah, no, no. We're not gonna call the police. We're not gonna call security. No, that's crazy. That is not. Yes, I know. I understand. Yeah. Sorry, my heart is ready. What well, I know. You want to talk to him? Is that what you want? Let me talk to him. Sorry, my boss wants to talk to you. I'm really sorry. Hello? Payback's a bitch. Oh, I got it. I got it. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> Did you dance your manhood into that young lady? At first I felt a little bit guilty about taking all of the intimate knowledge I know about my husband and just using it like a weapon against him. But then I remembered 
He did it to me. Just look in the camera and admit that you are on CMT Road Franks. She got me. <laughs>